So today I'm just going to be showing you how you can calculate profit and loss actually when we're just trading. And this is uh, something that you don't have to miss because it's just going to be helping you actually to know uh, the amount of, um, amount of money you're just going to make anytime you just place a trend and uh, to place all those things. So this is a crucial, a uh, very important thing that you have to know as a trainer so i'm just going to be sharing my screen right here and i'm going to explain this so that you can just understand uh in a very easy way so as you can see right here i've just placed this one over here so you can see there are two pairs over here the reason i place those two pairs actually is just because they are different okay and you can see that the price is that's just moving right here so you can see we have euro usd and dollar the reason i place those two is because uh, the way they are just in decimals is they are different so when we wanted to actually just have the profit and loss yeah, uh all of this so we just need to calculate what we call points we need points here okay so after we get point then there is the lot site that you will have used to make to me a lot size in africa palingapi so we just multiply times the lot size okay but remember this is different even how do you actually calculate this point it's just very easy you know when you just have to come over of the year so that you can just calculate the points so i'm going to make this easy so that you can just understand for example let's say uh, let's start with uh, the reason i'm getting the euro usd over here i'm going at um let me place here the reason i'm getting euro usd on the screen you can see okay maybe we can just take it the way it is let me just uh, screenshot so i'm going to work with this screenshot right this on being so that we can avoid the price uh, fluctuating every moment I, so we have the euro usd the reason i have six dollars over here let's start with the euro usd so i bought a price of one point uh zero eight okay six four seven and then the price has moved to one point zero eight six that is six okay um is that is it yeah so yeah so we can just work on this huh? so we can see how many points so the moment you just subtract this you get what zero point zero zero okay so you can actually even uh right start on the other side so that that is mathematically so you can start on the other side that will make sense you know that will make sense so here we have seven minus six which which is one we have one eleven here okay then the others become zeros okay point zero zero so we have zero point zero 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 movement now how do we get this to be points over here because you can see we have all those decimals last time we did not uh, describe this but this is what you can just do okay this is what you can just do just go to the pair of the euro usd and long press it if you're using mt4 or mt5 like the way you can see on your screen and the moment you just do that go to the properties okay so the moment you just go to the properties you can see where we have uh this contract size which is times 100,000. okay so you just multiply this times 100,000. okay so what do you get we have three uh these three zeros carry three zeros and we have this carrying these two decimals so we have one two three four five okay so we have 11 points okay if you multiply that then you're just going to get 11 points okay so this 11 point 11 point you just multiply times well loss size that we and used is just up here so we used a loss size of 0 0.1 and you can see is 11 times 0 0.1 which is 1.1 dollars so our profit and loss is actually 1.1 dollars in that scenario so on our screenshot you just saw that okay let's have another screenshot for euro usd uh that is dollar uh gold 
I'm going to be having this screenshot of the gone right here. So let's just do this calculation so that you can just understand it. So I bought gone. So you just take the values the way they are so that you can know what you do. So you can just do this before doing anything so that you can just understand how much you want to lose and how much you want to earn in the forex market. Okay. So I have bought gone at 1968.29. Okay. And then the gold moved up to. So I want to see whether I'm going to get five point six dollars. So and then gold moved up to nineteen sixty seven point seven three. But remember, this is a loss. So um, I will just be subtracting it. But it will just be negative. Oh uh, no, that is selling. So it just moved from this. Uh, today so that was selling so it's profit okay so because it does sell if it was on buy it could buy a loss okay so nine minus three g6 we borrow one here so uh it becomes 12 minus this which is five point all these becomes zeros okay so we have how much we have 0 0.56 because all these zeros it does not matter because they're on the left side we have 0 0.56 then let's just go to the same thing to see the multiplier that we are going to get on the gold side so we just long price this remember to go to the gold and go to the properties and then you'll see the contract size is 100 so we multiply this times 100 remember this will just give us 656 points okay so we multiply times what lot size which is lot size of 0 0.1 that i have used okay you see the lot size you can just under adjust it so that's where you see we got 5.6 dollars so 56 times 0 0.1 is actually 50 5.6 dollars so you can see that how easy it is remember this calculation you are not supposed to do it after you have entered into the trend all those calculations actually you just have to do them uh before you just place the trend the reason i'm saying this is that you can just know the amount of money you're willing to risk and the amount of money that you just want to earn so that you can just have a good risk reward ratio so i'll not tell you to subscribe if you love this video if you just understand my videos you make sure that you subscribe you make sure that you like this video and share to your friends it will just be a very benefit of you so i will see you next time make sure that you comment if you have any question i'll just reply to you all your questions see you next time bye bye